Hello, Brahmas people. My name is Majigu, and you might be wondering, who am I, and what am I doing on this channel? Basically, I'm one of Ramza's friends, and he's sick, so I'm filling in for him this week. And uh, we're just going to continue uh, the, the Rated Battles Boss series, and I hope you'll enjoy this. So, today I am bringing this uh, rain team, and I, I recently got this team, and I'm going to try it out. So, why, why not just dive right into it? Okay, so, I don't really have any scores or anything, because the wins and losses are not locked for guests, so we're just gonna f battle here, so this is gonna be fun. Okay, so this is a Japanese guy, and he's got a lower rating than me, so, okay, so, he's got a pretty basic OU team here. Um, he has three megas to choose from, so, that's pretty interesting. Um, I'm thinking he's gonna lead with the Raikou, so I'm not entirely sure what I should send in, but I know that he's he has three water types, and that's not that good for my team because I am, as you can see, um, a rain team. So I'm thinking I'm going to lead off with uh, Politoed just to get the rain up, and then I'm gonna have Galvangela and I'm thinking I'm thinking Swampert should be in here too so let's just dive right into it and see what this guy's got Okay, I don't know his name, so I can't pronounce it, but... Alright, let's see what he sends out. Oh, okay, Gengar. That's fine with me. So, I can't really toxic him or anything. Um, he might go for a Giga Drain. I'm not sure. But... I don't really think he can do much against Swampert, so I'm gonna go for it, and I'm not entirely sure if he's gonna go for Giga Drain or not, but if he goes for Giga Drain, I'm screwed. Okay, he's, he's taunting me. Okay, that was predictable, but, oh yeah. Okay, so I'm just gonna go straight into a Mega Evolution and Waterfall him. I'm not entirely sure if he's gonna switch out or not, but he is most likely ch um, focus ashed because he's not mega. So I'm I'm kind of curious. That didn't do much. Well, Swampert is very bulky. Yep, he's focus ashed. Of course, of course. Yep. Well, he might switch out, but. I'm gonna go for another waterfall. And that takes him out because a swift swim in ring is double speed. And the taunt wears off, so I can use stealth frog as I want if I want to, but I don't really find that necessary. Okay, Lopany, okay, I can see a fake out coming here. I can totally see you figure out, but on the off chance that he doesn't go for a fake out, I'm I'm, I'm just gonna go for a waterfall. I'm thinking the fake out is coming right now because that's usually what Lopinis do. do. <laughs> and yep, fake out, of course. Didn't do much, but still got me in the half. I think I can take him out with a waterfall. Okay, high jump kick, he's faster. Okay, crap. Oh, it's a crit. Crap. Well. That is sad news for me.
So I'm just going to go back into Politoed and then I'm just going to go for a Scald and hope that I can survive another. Okay, I hope that I can survive this, okay, easily. But I'm hoping for a burn. Nope, no burn. Dang it. Oh yeah, that's nice. He took himself out. Haha. <laughs> oh yeah. So... That was lucky. Better than a burn. Who knows what happens in these battles. Okay, so... Starmie... Starmie is pretty bulky. But... I might as well... I might as well just stay in. Okay, he's got Thunderbolt. Of course. And I'm dead. Of course. And he's life out. And of course the rain stops just as Polito dies. Well, Galvantula should be able to take him out with a thunder. But if I'm not, then I'm kind of screwed. I hope... Of course... I am really screwed. <laughs> if this doesn't kill, then that's a loss. And that's a win. That was... that was an alright battle. I haven't tried the team out before, so... That was pretty great. So, let's just dive into another battle and hope that I don't face some weird OP as shit OU team. <laughs> uh. Okay, let's just go for another battle and see where it takes us. Battle box. Okay, so we're just waiting for an, an opposing trainer to be found. So basically, this okay, this guy is from Japan as well. Yeah, of course. And this is another OU team with an egg slice, of course. So I'm thinking. I'm gonna go with Politoed once again. And Swampert seems like a good choice here as well. And then I'm kind of leaning towards Excadrill. I'm just not sure if I should grab Excadrill or not. I think um I think I'm gonna go with Bear Tick. Bertic has some pretty a pretty good pretty good advantage advantage here. Let's see what you got, Japanese girl. i I'm really not fond of there being no training customization in this game. Especially because um just in multi battles you're just the same person like there's for instance four Brendans and stuff okay this guy's definitely scoffed but he won't be able to take me out okay, okay he's not scarfed I suppose he's just really fast stealth rock that's fine. It served its its purpose. I'm just gonna take this guy out and that's an easy first Pokemon to take out. <laughs> <laughs> By the way, I hope all of you had an amazing Christmas and a good time with your families. Because that's always a good thing. I hope you got some good uh, Christmas presents. 
and this guy yeah he okay he's he's a mega he might go for um he might go for sword stance or then he might go for something else but i don't think he's gonna go for steel type move oh and i got the burn that's great okay he goes for the u-turn that's not gonna do much of course doesn't do much let's see what his last pokemon is a sumeril okay okay Well, I'm thinking he's gonna go for a play rough here, and I hope to get a burn. Nope. Yep, he goes for a play rough, of course. Okay, that take that almost takes me out. Um, there's really no point in staying in, so. The rain's gonna... <sighs> yeah. Mm. I'm just gonna go for another skull, then hope for a burn. Okay, he's not banded. Okay, that... That works out for me. That means he is... Most likely a belly drum set. And of course, I'm gonna take stealth rock damage. Um, okay, why did I go into bear take? <laughs> uh, he can't really do crap. Uh, didn't really think about it. I'm just gonna go for a play rough. It won't do crap, but okay, that was a mistake. <laughs> uh, yeah, that was a mistake. Yeah, doesn't... Oh, it was even a crit. Well, that doesn't really do crap. <laughs> okay, I'm switching out into a Swamp Herd. Because Bitchy cannot do crap because I'm banded. And that's not really a good thing for me. And he's going for a roost. Why did I not predict that? Anyhow, I'm gonna Mecha and then I'm going to Earthquake. Because this guy can't really do much to me. I'm thinking he might switch out into a Sumeril. But then again... Assume really can't really do much to me either. Hmm. He's staying in. I think he's got something up his sleeve. Okay, he's u turn he's u turning. Won't do much. Yeah, it doesn't do that much. Okay, so I don't think uh, his Assumeril has anything against getting an Earthquake in his face at all. Okay, then. That's gonna two-shot him. Well, the rain stops, so... He is obviously gonna be faster than me. Okay, no, he's not. I thought he was gonna at least Aqua Jet me or something like that. Oh, then he's just sacking it off. I think he knows he's lost. At I think he knows that he has lost at this point. Because he can't really do much with a Caesar. Okay, he forfeited. Of course. <laughs> I still take that as a win. But, yeah. 
I'm not gonna save that because I, I didn't really get the entire match on. on to. So. Anyhow, let's go for a third battle. This main team is working pretty well, um, I think. So far, at least. <laughs> And my rating is going up again. So two wins and zero losses in this battle. Cause okay, another Japanese guy. Okay. Ah. Uh, no. Oh no. Not Chris Selly. Not Chris Selly. Oh my God. This is such a typical OP OU team. Ugh. Um well I'll need to bring Polytoad for this and Swampert as well. Hmm I think Bear Tick would be good as well. Alright, let's dig into this battle. I say that a lot. <laughs> and sorry if you don't like battle theme. Um, I just really think that the m the Mac Melita themes are fitting for this. All right, so he leads up with the Venusaur, and that's not a good matchup for me because. He's most likely Mega. If he Megas, he's gonna have thick... Yeah, that... Yeah, he's Mega, of course. This is not gonna do crap against this guy. And he's most likely gonna either one-shot me or two-shot... Okay. Oh, he goes for the sleep power. Oh, wow. Well. That doesn't do crap, okay. He's a defensive. Well... Oh! Two misses in a row. Yes! I got the burn. He might go for rest or something like that. Well... I don't I don't really want to switch out into any of my other Pokemon because this guy's just gonna keep going okay. Yep, he is a stalling he's a staller. Of course. Okay, I I don't really feel like doing this right now. I really hate people who do stuff like this. Freaking stallers. I hate Mega Venusaur so much. It's really a pain in the ass. Okay, and of course he goes for Kick Drain again. And wow, that does surprisingly a lot. Hmm. Please don't miss. <laughs> um, this is stab, and this is most likely not going to do that much. But of course, he goes for Giga Drain. Oh my God! I wish people would just stop doing stuff like this. This really gets on my nerves. Because this guy... He doesn't... Oh! At least it dies! This guy already got on my nerves. Of course, he has Cresselia. 
and if I'm correct, this guy is a special. Is a yeah, he's a he's a defensive. Oh god, <laughs> uh, thunder wave. That's never a good thing. He's gonna one shot me with the next attack. Yeah, psychic, of course. Well, this gives me a chance to set up the rain again. And I'll have to try and burn him with a scald or something. Actually, no. I'm gonna toxic him. If I survive. Okay, um. Okay, he has a guard jump. Okay, that's that works out fine for me. I should have ice beamed him though. But this guy is pretty typical troll guy. And um, yeah, that's a dead polytoad. Oh my god. I honestly don't think I can win this because the Cresselia is lurking in the back and it won't take crap for crap. But I think I'm gonna one shot him with an ice punch. So that's at least something. And he's scarfed. Oh my god. Scarf jump. Yeah, I'm not winning this battle. That Cresselia is going to kill me off as fast as it can. <laughs> yeah, there's not really anything I can do about it. I'm just gonna go for a waterfall and hope that I can at least get it down to a fair amount of Oh god, it's a rocky helmet and I'm dead. I'm dead, yeah. So two wins and one loss. Had to go somewhere. That was really a disappointing battle, but because he was, he was just stalling. Anyhow, I hope you enjoyed this video, and please do leave a rating for the video. And if you haven't yet, please subscribe to Ramus. He makes the best videos on YouTube from a PokeTuber, and I hope you had a great time watching this and if you have any suggestions for any Pokemon you want to see in an upcoming video from either me or Ramos feel free to write it in the comment section below and I have a question of the day so um, what did you what did you what did you guys get for Christmas well I want to know Anyways, have an amazing day and thank you for watching. Bye.